Hello viewers, welcome back to Adelde Math Class. Today we shall be solving this question. But before we proceed, please don't forget to give this a thumbs up. So the first thing for us to do is to name this our equation one and name this our equation two. So the first step is to multiply equation one and two. So we multiply one by what two so for us to do that we have that two to the power of a multiplied by two to the power of b multiplied by three to the power of a multiplied by three to the power of b this equal to 12 multiplied by 18 and don't forget from the rule of indices that if you have a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n is the same thing as saying a to the power of m plus n so the same thing will be used to proceed with this question so here we have 2 to the power of a plus b multiply by 3 to the power of a plus b so 12 can be split as 6 multiplied by 2 while 18 can be written as 6 multiplied by 3 so with this there's another rule of indices i would like to mention here which is when you have a to the power of m multiplied by b to the power of m this is the same thing as saying a b to the power of m so that is when you have the same power then you can multiply the basis together while you repeat the power so using the same thing here i'm going to have 2 multiplied by 3 which is going to give me 6 to the power of what a plus b equal 6 2 multiplied by 3 here is the same thing as 6 so here we have 6 multiplied by 6 multiplied by 6 which is the same thing as saying 6 to the power of 3 again the rule of indices that says that if you have a to the power of n equal a to the power of n then you say that m equals n so using the same rule then i can say that here i'm going to have a plus b equal 3 let me call that equation 4 equation 3 so let's proceed with this also the next step for us to do is to divide equation 1 by 2. So equation 1 is 2 to the power of a multiplied by 3 to the power of b over 2 to the power of b multiplied by 3 to the power of a equal 12 over 18 so for us to produce with this to proceed with this we have that 2 to the power of a over 2 to the power of b multiplied by 3 to the power of b over 3 to the power of a equal 2 over 3 that is dividing this by 6 you have 2 dividing 18 by 6 we have 3 so using the rule of indices also for this i'm going to have 2 to the power of a minus b multiplied by 3 to the power of b minus a or equals 2 over 3 so with this i'm going to have 
2 to the power of a minus b over 3 to the power of a minus b because this is the same thing as writing minus a minus b okay and this in reciprocal form this can be in reciprocal form so we have this equals 2 over 3 so with this we can form equation 4 so my forming my equation 4 i can have that since we have the same power so here i have 2 over 3 my power is going to be a minus b equal 2 over 3 to the power of 1 so forming equation 4 i have a minus b equal 1 let me call that my equation 4 so now combining these two equations together here equation 3 which is a plus b equal 3 and then equation 4 which is a minus b equal 1 adding the two equations together i'm going to have 2a equal 4 so dividing both sides by the coefficient of a which is 2 2 so here my a equal 2 so when you plug in a equals 2 into equation 4 so you can have equ equation 3 or 4 you have a plus b equals 3 which is my equation 3 so since my a is 2 we have 2 plus b equals 3 and then finally b equals 1 so for the pairs a comma b equal 2 comma 1 so this is my answer thank you very much for watching my video please don't forget to subscribe to this channel thank you